Winston Churchill's lisp did not stop him from changing history in World War II. He is known for his leadership as a military leader, writer, and orator. Churchill served as the Prime Minister of the United Kingdom twice, first from 1940 to 1945, and then again from 1951 to 1955. In World War II, Churchill's delivery had to be flawless to get his ideas across, but public speaking was not something that had come naturally to him. He had had to work hard over the years to overcome a slight speech impediment. He had a bit of a lisp and could not say the letter S very well, and overcame this impediment by controlling the rhythm, by controlling the delivery, by stopping and speaking slowly and carefully. This proves that the persistence and determination of a single person can change the world. We shall fight on the beaches, we shall fight on the landing grounds, we shall fight in the fields and in the streets.